Hello and welcome to the final week of Vlogmas. I want to say sorry first of all for not posting last week. I had a really horrible week and I was like, you know what? I'm not going to post it. I filmed a few days but it just, it wasn't, it wasn't what I wanted. It wasn't the content that I want to put out there, if you get what I mean. Um, so we are starting fresh with a new week and this is the week of Christmas. Christmas is in six days. I have not wrapped anything. I've not even bought all my presents for people. Like, I am never this disorganised with it. I, d I don't know what's happened this year, but I still need to buy for my dad um, and one of my friends. So I'm just a bit like, oh god, absolute nightmare. The only good thing is that Tommy and I have said actually we're not going to do presents this year because we did have a trip to Amsterdam booked after Christmas, but Holland's gone into a lockdown. So we're just going to like postpone that and that will be our Christmas present to enjoy in maybe like the spring. But yeah, there's a lot to do, so I'm feeling a bit stressed and yeah, it's been a bit of a manic Monday, um, just because I've had like lots and bits of bobs to do, but I am really excited. I feel like I'm finally feeling a little bit festive, which I'm so happy about because I spent the whole of December just being like, I don't know, I, I, there was days where I was like, this is like the most Christmassy day ever, and then I was like, but then it just feels like a regular day, but Finally, I feel like I'm getting there. I'm getting excited. So yeah, I'm excited to bring you along for the week. What am I doing this week? I, oh, it's my sister's birthday tomorrow. It's her 21st. How is she 21? I, I don't understand how this girl is 21. Like, that is really scary. I still feel like I'm 21 and she's gonna be 21. So that's tomorrow. Um, I've not wrapped her birthday present. Oh my God, I am a mess. I need to do that. Uh, and then I'm heading back home as well. We're gonna have um, a little festive like homey vlog be half London vlog half home vlog I think it's gonna be quite good um, So yeah, I'm really excited and I hope you enjoy the video Tommy and I have become Obsessed with this program. It's called glow up. Let me just pause it because I don't want to get copyrighted for the music But it's called glow up. It's on Netflix, but they actually have the newest season on BBC So we're watching series two um, but series three isn't out on Netflix yet, but it's so good. Like, I actually cannot begin to tell you. And the fact that Tommy enjoys it, like, you really enjoy this, don't you? Yeah, it's good. He was like, this isn't just, like, a girly program. He was like, this is art. So, <laughs> it, yeah, it's, it's really good. I'm also, I don't know why I've done this to myself, but I'm drinking an iced coffee right now. Um, it's quite late in the day. Sorry about the focus. But, yeah, it's quite late in the day. I don't know why I've decided to drink this. So, I feel a bit... Feel a bit hyper, um, but yeah. Also, don't just mind the mess. I feel like this area is a bit of a mess at the moment, but yeah. And I think we're just gonna literally sit here all day, well, all evening, and watch this because there's literally nothing else to do. I actually don't think I've had a more boring day. Like the start of this vlog, I am so sorry about how dull it is. It's like eight o'clock now. Tommy and I we haven't really done much. We've just kind of sat. We watched the finale of. Um, I forgot the name of it. Glow Up. Glow Up? Is that what it's called, Tommy? Yeah. Glow Up. Glow Up too, that's it. Um, and then I started watching Canada's Drag Race because that's on the BBC at the moment. But, oh, I don't know. There's something about Drag Race, the fact that it's been on pretty much consistently this whole year. I like, I'm not even excited for it because I'm like, oh, well, there's another season and then another season, which is amazing. But I'm like, mm, I just want to get excited for it. So, anyway, other than that, probably should start cooking, but it's like eight now, and I'm just not hungry. I bought, I mean, our fridge is very empty right now. I'll show you. So, yeah, this is currently the state of our fridge. It is as empty as can be. So, really, my only option is a bit of chicken with some seasoning. And then I bought this. I rate this so much, and I feel like no one else buys it, but... This is so good and it's healthy-ish, so I love it. And then I also bought, from Tesco the other day, I bought this soup. Wow, this is really, this is the content that I'm going for now. I'm just showing you my empty fridge. I just don't really know what to do. I'll have a think. You know what I am gonna do though? I'm gonna drink the rest of this because there's not a huge amount left and it is my favorite rosé in the world. And I know it's a Monday, but this week it's, it's all Christmas to me and I think you should, Drink whatever you bloody well want. So I'm gonna have this. Oh, such a good rosé. I had my dinner, I'm not gonna lie. It tasted 
so bad. I put like fajita mix in with the chicken and it just was disgusting. But I've actually just been going through some outfits for one of my styling clients. I know I shouldn't be doing this late at night, but I actually just love it. So it doesn't feel like work to me. Um, so yeah, I've actually got all of these tabs open, way too many tabs. I mean, there was a lot more open. I've actually started closing them. But yeah, it's been really fun. So yeah, I'm gonna send that across to her in the morning. There's actually some really good sales on my brands at the moment. I'm pretty sure every single brand is like 50% off. So just to let you know, I think the Boxing Day sales have started early. So yeah, anyway, I'm gonna go to sleep. I don't know why I keep showing you this jumper. Hang on, let me turn it around. Sorry, anyway, I'm gonna go to sleep now. I'm sorry that today was a little bit boring. The rest of the vlog is gonna be better though. So stay tuned for that. It's my sister's birthday tomorrow, so that will be a good exciting day although she's already demanding things i'm like babes it's not your birthday for another three minutes you can't be doing that but yeah anyway i'll see you guys in the morning hello happy tuesday sorry i'm vlogging on my phone i forgot my camera here with the birthday girl she's got a sash on 21 that's terrifying i'm so old if you're old, then I must be bloody ancient. So, we're here with my mum, dad, Sean. Yeah, this is um the one in Clary Wolf. It's actually quite nice. Look at the festive menu. Very cute. But yeah, if the audio is crap in this, I'm sorry. It's because I'm um I don't even know where to look. I think the camera's in. I don't know why I forgot my camera, but I did. But I'm excited for a little birthday lunch. Sorry, I actually forgot to film the food. I feel like where I didn't vlog last week, I am forgetting to vlog today. But we're We've just popped into the Zara in Canary Wharf. Oh my God, look at all these greens. Oh, oh, I love that. And this as well. This is a good Zara. Oh, this dress. I actually pulled this out for one of my clients. Let me see what it looks like in person. Oh, that's very pretty. A really lovely fabric as well. Oh, wow. Okay, this is actually probably one of the best Zara's I've been into. Oh, maybe I'll do a haul. No, I feel like I shouldn't do that. I shouldn't, can't really afford it. That's cute as well. Oh, I love it. So nice. Oh, hang on a minute. This top is everything. Oh, is it backless? Oh yeah, it's got like an open back. Okay, that is absolutely stunning. Love the detailing on the sleeves as well. Kind of wish these were satin buttons, not regular buttons, but yeah, it's cute. And this little bodysuit as well. Oh, I love it. Hannah's on the hunt for her birthday outfit tonight. She somehow managed to get a table at, what's it called, San Carlo? Yeah, the one on top of Selfridges. The one on top of Selfridges, which is sponsored by Dior. It's gonna be so nice. I've seen it all over TikTok. Oh. That's cute though. Very it's like Jacquemus. No, I think it's gonna be attached though. Whoa. Is that one breaking as well? Oh yeah. Uh, yeah, see that one's... Oh, this is the problem with Zara, like their stuff. In that theory looks nice, nice but it's just damaged. Yeah, that's the loose as well. Don't buy these. I just don't know if the quality is good enough. No. That's such a shame. Do you like this bodysuit though? These are good quality actually. These are lovely. It's actually really pretty in here. Like the decorations, they remind me of my Christmas tree. They're really, really nice quite busy but i guess everyone's last minute christmas shopping i still need to buy my dad presents oh germinone lovely okay we are on the hunt for dad's present um is it in the window it's a jeremy clarkson book all i know is it's that much like i don't really know what it looks like um so yeah let's hope i can find it okay i got it diddly squat a year on the farm this looks like utter rubbish, I'm not gonna lie. Um, but if my dad wants it, then he wants it. Tell you what, Canary Wharf is very pretty at Christmas. Um, it's weird, I actually used to work around here, not in Canary Wharf, I just used to work at one of the restaurants. Um, but can you see like all the trees behind me? They look so nice. I wonder if I can turn the camera around, I might have to like start recording, but yeah. It's really cute, I've absolutely no idea where I am. Like for someone that worked here for so long, not got a clue. Also, I'm sorry if this water beach is a bit loud. Um, I also bought some wasabi. They do chicken katsu sushi and it is literally the best thing ever. So I'm gonna have that. This is why I should like, this is why I never will get a job in the city. Like being a business city girl because I would get lost. Oh, hang on. I think I know where I am. Can I cross before the cars? 
Yes, I can. Oh my God. Okay, sorry, this is a very traumatic part of the vlog. I'm sorry. Back at the flat now and back on my camera. I'm sure you can probably tell the quality difference. Got myself, I was a bit greedy. I got myself two of the like sushi wasabi things. They are so good that I just was like, I need to. Um, I also, I've just had a package arrive from Givenchy Beauty, which is very bougie. So I'm gonna open that for you. Um, yeah, very excited. They've always got such lovely like packages and the products are actually unreal as well. So I'm excited for this. Sorry about the dishwasher noise as well. I know you probably can hear it, but I think this is a new range with Givenchy. So this is Blanc Divin. Um, so we've got a powder, which is amazing. I actually only bought a powder the other day, so. I'm annoyed that I wasted the money on that powder now. Then this is like a moisture mask, moisturizing mask. And then we've got one of their lipsticks. I love their lipsticks. I love the nude ones. I think this is more of like a red shade. But I think this is like, I don't know if it's like a build your own lipstick or it's like showing off the refill options that they have. But it's a lovely present nonetheless. I'm very grateful. I love the packaging. I think this box is very cute, the way it says Givenchy, although you probably can't see it. Um, but yeah, thank you, this is so cute. I've changed into my, my comfies now. The set is actually from Naked Fashion, I love it. Um, I'm also about to eat my chicken katsu sushi. I've got my soy sauce, my wasabi ready. I, I actually can't tell you how excited I've been for this. I've put it off for about an hour, but now I'm like, I need it, because it's just the best thing. And I know I keep going on about it, but until you try it, you have to trust me, like this is unreal. So I am very excited. I probably will eat all of this and then all the other one in the next like 20 minutes, but what can I do? It's delicious. I have absolutely no right to be as tired as I am considering all I did today was go out for lunch. Um, but I am shattered. And so you're tired as well, aren't you? No, I'm solid, mate. Don't feel tiredness. He literally said like two minutes ago how tired he was. Um, trying to act hard for the camera. <laughs> But yeah, Tommy was like, what I, apparently what I do when I get tired is I just get slower and slower with like responses and just in general. So that's my body being like, right, we're shutting down. You've got to go to sleep. So that is what I'm going to do. I've got a big day tomorrow. I've got to film a YouTube video for, well, it's like a mix of different brands. It's like a, it's like an outfits. I was going to do it with my rail and do like proper outfit style, but I think I might do it more vlog style, not vlog style, like haul style. Um, so yeah, I say it's a big day, it's not really a big day, there's not really much, but I'm, going home yeah, I'm going home, oh yeah, that's true, I'm going home tomorrow, I'm going to see the family, I'm going to see my cats, which I think will be very sweet, I'm very excited to see my cats, I'm not going to lie, um, so yeah, anyway, before I bore you even more with my tiredness, I'm going to say goodnight. Hello, it is, I think Wednesday today, I'm getting very confused with the days, I hope it's Wednesday, um, I'm actually just about to film a little, like, festive Christmas outfits, New Year's Eve outfits video. I know Christmas is literally like, like four days away, so it's probably gonna be more New Year's Eve themed, but I haven't uploaded to YouTube on my main channel in a really, really long time. Um, just, I just feel like I've, December was just a bit mad and I didn't really have time for it. We're gonna hit it, we're gonna hit it in, in January, and January is gonna be a good month, um, but I wanna get this video up just as like the last one of the year, and then January is gonna be a big one, but I need to get my lights up. Um, I haven't actually got too much to do. I feel like I put a lot of pressure on myself for this video, but then I'm actually like, it's quite an easy one to film. So I'm gonna crack on with that, and I'll see you after I've done it. Video is all filmed. It was, it was all right, it was a good one, I think, hopefully. Um, I've actually started packing. I need to get home, I needed to leave. 40 minutes ago, um, but I haven't, so it's not really going very well, but there's just a lot of stuff to take home, even though I'm back for like four, five, I think five days, if it's 20 second, 20, yeah, so like five days, I've just got a lot of stuff, like I've not wrapped anything, so I need to take my wrapping paper and just like, just other random bits with me, so yeah, it's just, it's just a lot, but it'll be fine. I feel sad that I'm leaving Tommy though. No, it's only five days. Yeah, and then I'm picking, I'm picking up from his house, so I'll see him on the 27th. So I think we, because we were meant to go to Amsterdam, obviously, so that's been cancelled. So I think we'll just spend those days, like, just cosy and 
I feel like the days between Christmas and New Year anyway, they're not real, like they don't feel real. So I think we're just gonna like chill, watch films and it'll be nice. But yeah, anyway, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna head home. I'll probably film when I'm back at home. It's gonna be a bit of a rush. So <laughs> sorry if the, like the next few clips of the vlog are just a bit of a nightmare. I just know that I run late for literally everything I do. I am home. I'm back at the family home. I bless my mum and dad with my presents. You're welcome. Mum wants to show me what she got in the hamper. Get a hamper every year for my dad's work. So what's this, crackers? Nice. What's that? Chocolates. Oh, I think it's truffles. Oh, lots of chocolate. God, there's a lot in it. Oh, uh, what are these? <laughs> Olives. Oh my God, they look awful. Whiskey mince pies, nice. Mm. Oh God, that stinks of cinnamon. No, it's a lot of nuts. What are these? <gasps> these look like marshmallows. What are they? Luxury pods. Uh, yeah, I'll take both of no, these. No, yeah, you thank won't. you. Oh, and then, and no. that lovely. <laughs> I'm gonna have a piece of this fudge. I love fudge so much. Excuse me. Sorry. What else have we got? Oh, lots of alcohol. What is that? Nougat. 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 Mm. Port. Cranberry with contro. Oh wow. Nice. Oh, what's this? Coffee. Oh, no, not that. Champagne. Wow. My God, we should all get a I job at my dad's work. Wow. Um, nice. Oh, was there cold stuff in it then? Wow. This is nice, but I am going to have some of that fudge. Oh, we found Poppy. She loves flowers. Like, I cannot even begin to tell you how much she loves flowers. She was staring at them because they were up here and um, she was just staring at them and I knew that she wanted to be near them. Look at her. She just like shoves her face into them. It's so cute. Oh, Poppy. You're so sweet, little Moo. Nice. Oh, isn't that lovely? Oh, <laughs> is that nice, me? I've just realised something. I've left all my best clothes at my family home because I was trying to think of an outfit today and I was like, I was really struggling in the flat. Come back home, forgot I had this gorgeous little top from Revolve, which is like this beautiful beige long sleeve top, stunning. And then this coat, which is misguided from last year, but Zara do have one very similar. And I just think it's so nice. So I, I literally would never even thought of this outfit, I just forgot. But I've got my, these would come from London, my leather trousers and my boots. It's a very dark outfit and I'm sorry if this clip's very dark, it looks very dark on the camera. Oh, we brightened up. My camera doesn't even know what colour to be. But yeah, this is my outfit for the evening. I'm excited. I feel like Rockwater is, it's quite new. It looks quite bougie. I feel like out of all the places in Brighton, it's probably like one of the bougiest. So I'm really looking forward to it. So we have just arrived at Rockwater. I'm with Katie, doesn't she look gorgeous? How amazing is this? Like I genuinely cannot believe that this is in like the Brighton area. Quite, well, I'd say it's like London prices, but it's very much like a London vibe. We were saying that this is like a good place for a first date. Um, because there's three floors, so you've got this floor, we basically went really wrong. So there's three floors, there's this one, which is a bit more bougie, and then there's like kind of more pub vibes. Uh, not not pub vibes, but like cozy vibes. It's just really nice in here. So yeah, I think I'm gonna get myself a porn star martini. Oh bloody hell guys, Katie and I are literally the fussiest people in the world. We take one look at the menu and be like, oh no. <laughs> so we're going to go downstairs, which means I can show you what the downstairs looks like. But yeah, this looks good for brunch though. Like the breakfast looks nice. Um, but yeah, the rest is like quite fishy. Um, so yeah, I don't know. But we're going to move down. It's still cute down there though. Okay, we've moved now. We've come to the bar downstairs, which is very nice. Um, we've got myself my porn star martini, so I'm happy. What I'll do is I'll show you the food, because Katie and I need a big old catch up, but I'll show you the food and then I will catch you guys later. Oh, this looks amazing. We've got a burger with some chips, like nice and simple, but it looks unreal. Also, porn star martinis would 100% recommend. They are so good. Just got back home. It's about, it's not even 10 o'clock. Ollie does this, he just takes himself to bed. It's so cute. 
Why do you do it? Are you tired? So sweet. He's had this bed since he was a kid and it's actually disgusting. I don't know why mum and dad haven't bought new ones. Um, but hello little floof. So cute. You know what I'm going to do now? I'm actually going to watch Emily in Paris. The new season came out. So do you want to watch it with me? Do you want to come up? Do you want to come up with me? You come with me? No, he's like, I want to go to bed. Leave me alone. I've actually really missed propping you up on my bed here. I feel like this is the best place to put you. Um, I used to do it all the time when I lived at home, but I feel like most of you guys that have followed me, like, this year, I think you've probably only followed me since London. So, welcome to my old bedroom. It's um, a lot tidier than it used to be. And it's quite pink, but, yeah, like I said, I'm going to watch Emily in Paris. It's... I honestly feel like it's one of my favourite programmes. I know a lot of people were like, mm, I I'm not sure about it, but I actually really enjoyed it. And you know what else I'm really enjoying is the new Sex and the City series. I think it's called And, and Just Like That. It's really good. People are hating on it. I'm enjoying it. I just love a bit of TV. I love fashion. TV that's got good fashion, like that is the key to my heart, um, which is why I like that glow up programme Tommy and I have been watching as well. But um, I don't know what my laptop is. To be honest, I don't, I've got absolutely no idea. But I bought, so I got some new skincare. I was actually going to buy this for my sister, but I decided to keep it. And I'm going to try it out tonight. So it's a gift set. It's from Fenty. I got it in Boots. And it's got their overnight recovery gel cream. It's got the fat water, which I've heard literally incredible things about. And then also the lip balm. But I don't know if you can see, you probably would have seen it more on Monday. But like, I have got this spot that has just been there for like, probably about five or six days now. It, it just might budge. It's very upsetting. So I'm hoping that this fat water is going to do the job and try and clear it before Christmas. Because that is my aim. Um, but yeah, anyway, I'm going to take my makeup off, get ready for bed, watch Emily in Paris. And then I will see you guys in the morning when we have... Oh my god, two sleeps till Christmas. I've not wrapped anything still. I need to wrap presents up tomorrow. I'll do a montage of me doing that tomorrow at some point. Anyway, good night. Hello, it is Thursday today. Joining you in my very chaotic house, my sister has just arrived. I've got Liam here who edits all my videos and is currently doing something very strange to my light. Um, got my tripod. So yeah, it's quite a busy house at the moment, but it's nice. It feels very like Christmassy. Um, but yeah, we've got lots of, Liam's very sweet. He's bought me all like new camera and light equipment stuff for Christmas. So thank you. It'd be more interesting. It's very kind. Huh? It'd be more interesting in a minute. Oh wait, there's more. Oh my God. Okay, hang on one sec. Look at all this tech. So we've got a soft box for the lights now. So next time you see a main channel video, I will be lit beautifully. But it's really cool. It just attaches onto the back of my light. So it feels nice and secure. Oh. Oh no, I've just broken it. Oh God, oh thanks mum. Got the pizza, that is the best thing about being at home. Just the food gets made for you. And then we've also, I won't drop it on the sofa. And then we've also got the mic um, and like this cool tripod. Sorry about all my family screaming in the back, lol. My camera keeps focusing on the tree behind me and not um, me. So apologies if I go in and out of focus. So Liam has left now. We had a right old catch up about plans for 2022 on YouTube and it's going to be big. So if you guys, I mean, I really hope you are subscribed to the other channel because um, the content is a lot more professional on there. But if you're not, I would really appreciate it if you do go over there because it's going to be a good year of content. I'm actually now going to finish watching Emily in Paris. I don't know what episode I got up to. I think I got up to maybe like episode six. Six. Uh, let me give this a refresh. I think it was episode six. Ah, okay, episode five. So I've actually got half of the episodes left to watch, which is very exciting. So probably going to just watch this. I know I said I was going to wrap presents today, but I just, I can't bring myself to do it today. I feel really tired. Oh, hi, Ollie. Hello. What's he sniffing? So weird. Um, so yeah, I'm going to do that tomorrow, but... Yeah, it's been a really nice day actually. I went out earlier, I didn't film it, but I met one of my other friends and that was really nice as well. So it's just been a really nice kind of catch up day, like catching up with people from home, which I, I don't really get to do very often. Um, what is this cat doing? Holly! Hello! Oh, he's walking off now. Where are you going? Where are you going, babes? You're going into the utility room. 
Come on then, jump up. Look at that, so well trained. Hi Moo, you say hello to everyone. So cute. Do they need feeding? Oh, it is a bit, uh, Ollie, it's a bit early for food. I feel like this is the coziest little spot. So I'm tucked up, I've got my blanket. Ollie's joined us. Oh, he's giving you a bit of a dirty look, isn't he? Watching the holiday. Mum's here. Cozy girls evening with Ollie. We're having a great time. Um, but yeah, look how cute all my mum's little Christmas decorations and stuff are. It's very sweet. This is probably the most unfestive dinner. But we've got fish and chips. There's a fish and chip van that actually comes near the house. And... We thought that we would get some tonight. It's really good. Like my mum and dad have said on multiple occasions that this is better than any fish and chips that you can get like by the sea. Is it better than the one in Devon that you used no, to get? It's, um, with, in Whitby. In Whitby. In Whitby, Yorkshire. Apparently it's better than Whitby. Oh, okay. So there you go. Very good fish and chips. So I'm excited. Well, <laughs> I'm not eating fish. I'm eating chicken nuggets, but the chips are good. Happy Christmas Eve from the heart. So we've got Hannah looking like a little sad dog <laughs> looking out the window. Um, the roads are quite busy today. We're on the way to Coke Brasserie for our Christmas Eve lunch. We always try new places or like we've been to Coke before, but we've not been there at Christmas time. That's what I'm trying to say. So that is the plan. The roads are, yeah, the roads are quite busy. People are queuing for petrol. So there's another mad rush for it, which is good. It's not really that good, but yeah, just thought I'd say hello. We're in our beige outfits today. Oh my god, we are actually quite like I'm wearing blue. in sync. Yeah, mum and dad are not matching us, but Hannah and I, we got the memo. Um, and I'm very hungry actually, so I'm excited for me? some food. Well, what are you wearing? Beige. Ba well, I think it's more of a mustard. Wait, this is what you wore the other day when we were out for lunch for Hannah's birthday. I don't have many other things. Where's no. the same thing? I'm not allowed. <laughs> rationed. <laughs> Cheers everyone, happy Christmas Eve! Oh sorry, oh Hannah, oh we're doing the boomerang as well. Ready. Behind the scenes. Dad always in it. Dad, keep your eyes back. Back, no, back. How does it look? <laughs> you can just see Dad's. Dad's <laughs> it won't even focus. For God's sake, There we go. Oh, <laughs> so oh smile. Oh my goodness. So for Maine, we are treating ourselves. We've got a Chateau Brion with some confit potatoes, which look really good. Some fries. I think mum and dad are waiting on some people. Well, they've already got started. Good chips? Oh my gosh, there are chips. Oh, wow. Mm, thanks for that. Anyway, very excited to get stuck into this. We decided instead of getting dessert at Coat that we would get some bits from Casper's. I think it's a chain. I think there's a few Casper's around. I've seen them in London before. So I got a chocolate waffle. Hannah got cookie dough. Oh my god, Hannah, that looks so good. And then, yeah, that actually looks unreal. And then mum and dad got these little cake things. But Hannah went for ice cream and I feel like I've messed up now. So I didn't get ice cream. Oh my God. Hi, Ollie. You know what? I don't think our cats have hated us as much as they do right now. Look at that face. Ollie, he just wants to Ollie. leave. Let's put him in a little, little hole. Is that is that nice, Ollie? Are you enjoying yourself? Stop Sorry, I didn't mean to hit your foot. <laughs> oh, Ollie. Well, he was parrying and he's not anymore. No, because I don't think he's very happy, actually. No, no. I need to start wrapping some presents. I said I'd do a montage, but it's getting a bit dark now. But I'll do what I can. I just saw this on TikTok, and it's a snake game. You play it with your cat, and we've just got Ollie watching it. It's so cute. It's like cat TV. Do you see it, Ollie? Do you see it? Look at that face. He loves it. You like it. You like the Good snakes. Thing. Come on. I hate it when he does this. What's he doing? I don't know, just fixates. <laughs> yes, nice. Stop. 
Thank you, Norm. Oh, this is so cute. No, look at the screen. I can see his eyes. I don't think he really cares that much. Isn't it Poppy who usually plays and taps no, the screen? No, he taps the screen as well. What are you looking at? I think he's looking to see if the snake's hit. No, it's there again. Look. Oh my God. What's wrong with him? What are you looking at? This is our entertainment. <laughs> what, is, what is happening right now? Oh God, okay, the montage has already failed. I dropped the camera, it just, it's not going well. So what I'll do is show you a before and then I'll show you an after in three, two, one. All wrapped up. So I think I only, how many should I wrap? Was it seven, one, two, three, four? Yeah, seven presents. But I'm very proud of my wrapping. I need to find some labels actually. I don't know if I've got any to hand. Um, but I like the kind of gold and white vibe. I think it looks very chic. Um, so yeah, very, very happy with these, but I've got to try and remember whose is whose because I've, I'm kind of forgetting already now that they're wrapped up, so. Oops, but very proud, love them. So Hannah goes, does everyone want a glass? And proceeds to fill, fill them like double. Is that empty now, that bottle? Really, is that not a normal glass? Well, I, I'd love it. I'll, I'll take it. I'll do it. That's fine. Yeah, it's all right. We'll drink it. Thank you, babes. That's a normal size glass. <laughs> Is comment, it not? Comment Is below. Do you have it half full? I don't know. I don't know. I'm happy to drink this. Oh, did he actually? That is so cute. Just put his paw on mum. So we're sat watching the Polar Express, which is our always tradition. yeah tradition that we watch every single. Christmas Eve, while stuffing, while stuffing Pringles, and Hannah's actually usually not here, so this is rare. I've been out oh, Mum, once. look at his face, he's looking up. Our old cat Simba used to eat Pringles, like he used they to love them. Head, yeah, yeah, funny little thing. But yeah, anyway, I'm gonna say goodnight for tonight. I'm actually gonna vlog tomorrow, Christmas Day, so hopefully that'll be a good one. So I'll see you guys in the morning. Good morning and Merry Christmas. I feel so tired. My mum and dad were up so early. So then I was up early, but they're so funny because they get just as excited as us. So we're gonna attack the presents under the tree. We did our stocking presents. Um, I can show you that later. I, I did think about doing like a what I got for Christmas just in part of the vlog, but I won't make it very long, but yeah. Size of this tree, I still can't get over how big it is. Like it is actually massive in person. Um, but yeah, so excited. My mum literally exactly manages right. the presents. Yeah, look at, look at them, look at them. The Does anyone else have separate, so they have like your main presents and then you do tree presents a bit later. Because it's a stress every single year because no one says which presents are main and which are trees. So we just yeah, guess. It does. It says tree on oh, they do. Oh, some of them but don't. Mine doesn't. No. What? This is to Dad from Sam, Steve, Rebecca and Hannah. That's for Grand. Oh! <laughs> oh what is that going to be new? That was me. That was you. <laughs> Best <laughs> present, I feel like, goes to my nanny and grandpa for Dad's chef apron. Steve, cool chef. Yay! Oh, I love that. Look at all the mess. We're still not even done. Ooh, I think the mess is actually more here, but... Yeah, it's exciting! Okay, wanted to show you my Christmas Day outfit. I went for the jumpsuit. If you watched the video on my main channel, where I was basically like, trying on different outfits, I felt that this was the most flattering and most appropriate. The only thing is, is that my boobs sometimes fall out, <laughs> falls out this bit. Um, but, yeah. Got a bit of glitter on the eyes. Just very, like, simple makeup, but... Yeah, this jumpsuit is actually everything. I love it. We're just about to get started on Christmas dinner. Very full table. Oh, Grandad, do you want to do a cracker? Should I do a cracker? Ready? Three, two, one, go! Yay! There you go. That's your one. I think my one's here. Should you do my one as well? Ready? Oh, I got it again. <laughs> I feel like I've not really filmed a huge amount today. I think the last thing I filmed was maybe my Christmas dinner, but it was just like such a busy day with family and that. Um, but I did say I was gonna show you, I'm trying not to expose myself with this top. 
Um, I want to show you a few of the bits that I got. I don't want to show you everything because otherwise that's like a lot. Um, and I hope like you don't mind me showing you this. I, I purely just do it because I am so nosy about what other people get and I'm hoping that other people are the same. But the first thing I got is, and this is for my mum and dad, is the Velvetizer from Hotel Chocolate. I literally see so many people rave about these and my mum got my dad one and told me about it and I was like, wait, I really want one of these. So yeah, I've got that with um, some drinking chocolate as well. So I've got the like standard milk hot chocolate and then white hot chocolate which is lovely. Um, oh, my sister got me such a lovely present from Astrid and Miu. I've actually never had jewelry from them before, but they are the most beautiful little hoop earrings. Let me see if I can get that to focus. Oh yeah, there we go. So really lovely hoops. Um, so they're like gold. Don't know if you can kind of see that. So you kind of, they're like jeweled on one side and then gold on the other. I think they're really lovely. I also got a, lot of Jo Malone this year. Um, I think basically people know I love Jo Malone and I think they all just decided to buy me it which is great. I'm very grateful for it. So I've got the Blackberry and Bay candle. This one's from my sister. And then in here I think there's another Blackberry and Bay candle and then the body wash which I think is so lovely. Tommy got me my favourite perfume. Let me just grab it. So this is probably up there with like my favourite perfumes. I'd say this one and Coco Mademoiselle are my faves. This is La Belle by Jean-Paul Gaultier. It's actually one of those fragrances, whenever I wear it, someone will be like, what are you wearing? It's one of those. So I just don't think many people wear it, to be honest. Um, and then, what else? I don't know if there's um, much more. Oh, yeah, I've got another, another candle. This is the Mystique one from the white company so yeah just loads of lovely presents and i'm so grateful for them all um but yeah i hope you guys have had a lovely christmas and i probably won't be on the channel until the new year so i hope you have a lovely new year as well sending you so much love thank you so much for all your support this year it's honestly meant the world to me um so yeah let's make 2022 a big year so on that i will see you guys Next year. <laughs> Bye.